motorcycle stuff. Yeah, we got motorcycle stuff in the middle of winter. It is January and the motorcycle's tucked away in, in the shed. So uh, these folks here, now I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it because I don't even know if it's just a series of letters. Uh, X, Y, Z, C, T, E, M. These guys, X, Z, T, E, M. Uh, reached out, and I don't know if they had saw one of our videos that maybe I was putting my bike away and they realized, hey, your bike has no cover on it. And I was like, you're right, because when we moved, I don't know where the covers went. So I was like, they're going in a shed. They don't necessarily possibly really need one. Uh, I was out there the other day, and they are nicely covered in a, a, a nice little kind of frosty coating, which is lovely. Mm -hmm. Anyways, these guys sent us a cover uh, to put on the bike and uh, we're gonna crack it open because it's not a they they have a, a not a bad deal right now for sure $63 it looks like you can get a cheaper one uh, they have a bunch of different ones we'll talk about it um, but this one here as you see buy one ship two two for one that sounds kind of nice Okay, so before we open this up and head outside in the cold to put this on my bike, first off, if we go here, um, you can see shop by category, motorcycle covers, ATV covers, snowmobile covers, bike covers, even bike covers, right? So these are like, um, I don't know if this is just, they say bike covered, that looks like a motorcycle, but on the little picture there, which you can't, it's hard to see, that looks more bicycly. So I'm not a, I'm not a hundred, it says quality bicycle. So that's a super large bicycle. Um, ATV covers though. So if you're interested in ATV, look at those, you know, quads, four wheelers, uh, side by sides. All right. And last but not least, we'll kind of go in here motorcycle covers, which is what we have here. And it does look like they have a bunch of different ones. So outdoor, outdoor motorcycle cover. Uh, this is, this is, I think the one we got here. This one's sixty-three dollars. Uh, it looks like all of them right now. Honestly, all of them are buy one get one free. So I'm not sure. I think this is kind of the all-purposey one. This is the more of the indoory one, and this one here is the uh, winter. And then of course you have some other covers down here, which are probably just like these are just waterproof. So these would be nice covers if you are possibly traveling and you don't have a lot of storage or kind of just like a tarp is what my guess is. 300D, so that's uh, the same kind of material as some kind of, uh, actually like motorcycle gear is made out of. Out, outdoor motorcycle cover, it really does look more like a, like a tarp, you know, like a tarp that you put over top of it. But that's not, not, not too bad, I guess. Again, we got this one, I'm guessing based on the cover. Um, $62.99, and if you can get two, because you have two motorcycles for the price of one, that's that's pretty good. Um, here, here's your specs on it right here. Uh, there's a few things I actually like about it, just from just reading it. Number one, premium material, well, we'll see. We'll see when we open it, waterproof and dustproof. And I always talk about waterproof because I don't, I've had a bunch of different covers and it doesn't really matter what covers they are. I haven't had one yet that I took the, the cover off the bike after like a torrential downpour that the bike was perfectly dry. I don't know if it's just the amount of humidity that gets trapped in the cover, but there's always, it's always just a little damp. So whatever. Um, additional straps for security, which is great. So if you are like me, if you put a cover on, a lot of times I put a bungee cover or a bungee cable underneath to strap it so that no wind can blow it off. Or maybe you just want to actually put something and, and be able to lock it. Reinforced lock holes. So all kinds of things, and they have multiple sizes. Now, I'm putting this on uh, Versus, Kawasaki Versus, and they kind of show up here different sizes based on what you're looking at, and it says the size. Now, I went based on the length of my bike, so I looked it up in the specs. So I got an extra large, because that kind of says what it should fit. So that's the hope that it will. But has the info there, kind of kind of measure it and go from there. Anyways, one year warranty, durable, easy to handle and fold, lock holes, premium Oxford material, elastic wheel fit, cool, double stitched waterproof stripes, uh, buckle straps and reflective st strips, stripes, strips, stripes, whatever, 
windproof, water, waterproof, and anti-UV storage bag and fashionable packaging. Cause really in a motorcycle cover, fashionable packaging is what we need. Durable, all kinds of goodness. All right, should I open it in here? Yeah, I'll open it in here. And then we'll take it outside. And then we'll take it outside. I never thought, I was like, usually this time of year, it's like not much for motorcycle gear because you know, well, it's winter. But a cover, a cover is useful all the time. Especially for those of us that don't have one. Okay, ready? All right, so first off, off. It comes in this little bag, so if you're like, that's what you want. Um, you get this thing. I'm guessing it just kind of shows you putting it on, or they're just showing it on bikes to say, look, it works on a motorcycle. Uh, installation, I'm pretty sure you can figure it out. Mine says double XL. Now, maybe I got the double XL, because maybe I figured... I can't remember. Bigger is better. Here's your warranty card. Cool. Same photos on the side. But, oh yeah, double XL. I got a double XL. So you'll know now when I put this. So first off, their little bag. I'm going to show it to you because you have to see it. Their little bag here already tearing at the seams. So I have to show it because we're giving a review, right? Okay. So that little bag is taking a bit of a beating already. Okay. Nice little front motorcycle on there. And there it is. Now here's here's the extra here's the extra straps that you get. Okay, so you do get some straps. I think they say they're I can't remember two meters or something like that. We'll take a look. actually here. We'll open it because we're here. Okay. Am I gonna use these straps? Uh, I don't know. We'll see. So that is the strap length. So yeah, I probably say probably close to around two meters. Maybe, maybe, yeah, that's about a meter ish times two. So okay, that's good. It's it's useful. And this is the bag. Now it looks like pretty traditional bag. Now I want you guys to see this. Uh, I wouldn't say this one really is a winter bag. Now they do have a winter bag. This is kind of a maybe like an all season. It's uh, definitely this is definitely great for travel. It's not very thick. We definitely have a thicker one for my wife's bike already. That's that's fairly thin. You guys can can you see that? I'm hoping you can see that. But that's yeah. It's it's not super thick. So if you're looking for a thick cover, uh, I don't think you're gonna get it. But um, let's go let's go take it outside and see how it fits on the bike because that's kind of important. It does, it does fold up nice. So if you're gonna put this in your saddlebag or you're gonna put this in your, your your top case or something like that, it folds up nice. So I'll give it that. That should fit in the side bag good. All right, let's go outside. All right, so we've got our cover. Heading out to the shed. And I really do think that if you are someone that their bike is gonna be sitting out in weather like this, so it's going to be out in the middle of winter. You probably want to look at, without even putting this on, you, you want to look at the winter cover because you definitely want something thicker than this. But my bike's my bike's in here, so I'm just going to crack this open, and we'll we'll put this on. It's it's not hard. You guys can figure out how to put a cover on. Okay, so I'm about to put the cover on and you can you can definitely see that I've got frost <laughs> like there's frost on the bike uh, and that's probably a good reason to put any kind of cover on your bike while you're storing it for winter. So on it comes, on it goes, whatever. So I did want you guys see you to see this. There are straps on here for wrapping around that extra strap that's in the house that I'm not gonna be using it is exactly that. It's an extra strap. So it does have straps for folding it up and for securing it to the bike, which is which is kind of nice. 
Now the other thing, the other thing is these that lock, the locking rings, surprisingly large. Like they're actually much larger than I thought they were gonna be. So again, an, another little, another little plus. Okay, it's dark in here. So we have got it on. I'll turn this way, maybe you can see it better. Right, there it is there. Um, so I'm glad I didn't get just the uh, extra large. Because as you can see, hopefully you guys can see it, uh, it, it really just fits. And because the Versus is such a tall bike, it, it doesn't go all the way down to the ground for sure. Uh, but it fits good. The straps are useful. I actually strapped this one to the to the tires. I did that on the front. Now I could have put the one in the mid where you can see it right there. But because this is in the garage or the shed, I don't really think there's a need. I don't really think there's a need for that. So I think I think it's actually it's actually pretty good. Again, it's not really thick. It's not a thick like tarp motorcycle. Uh, cover if you're looking for thick and if you again if you were going to be outside in this kind of weather I'd probably want something thicker, but if you're traveling or if you're going to store it in a shed or a garage or something like that or Especially like in the in the spring and summertime where you're just going to get like rain Yeah, I think it'll be good. I like all the tie down straps and I like the big like security rings Those are those are quite nice and if you can get two for one that's that's not a bad deal. All right, guys, I'm gonna leave you there. Uh, that's our that's our new cover, new cover for the bike. Yeah, pretty good. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit the little notification bell, and uh, we've got three or four months before this comes out of here. That's sad. That's sad. Later.